Hello there, Basil here with another Scratch 2.0 video and this time I'm showcasing my zombie shooter game which I made in a few minutes using the new Scratch 2.0 um, beta. So basically what I did is I took the normal generic Scratch shooter type thing where you have an overhead view and you're shooting zombies and I used cloning to make it so the zombies are cloned and there's just one sprite and all of the clones come off the screen and they're the ones that you're shooting not the actual sprite and they delete themselves once they're shot and also the bullets are cloned so um, the sprite is um, just there's a, just one sprite and clones come from the barrel of the gun and delete themselves when they hit the edge of the screen so this is just a small project that I thought people might find interesting because it uses the whole new method of cloning another thing I would like to talk about in this video is uh, my plans for when Scratch 2.0 comes out so what I'll be doing with the channel um, one of the plans I have is to redo all of my tutorials, so all of the beginner tutorials and all of the um, advanced tutorials to redo them in Scratch 2.0, the full version, um, because I want to have them all up to date and um, so if what, someone has never used Scratch before, I want them to be able to use it and understand it completely, so I'll update them and add new features as, um, as Scratch 2.0 comes out. Also, I'll be keeping all of my 1.4 videos in a playlist, so I'll keep them all in one big playlist um, where you'll be able to see them all, so I won't just delete them off the channel. Something else I'd like to talk about is an upcoming project that I have that I plan to release to this channel, a video of it, and that is a Pathfinder. So a Pathfinder basically um, takes two um, points, so point A and point B, and tries to find the quickest route between the two of them. Um, I'm currently developing it, and um, you put down the walls, you put the start line and you put the finish line and it tries to get there in the least steps as possible. Um, I'm encountering a few problems with it because it's quite complex but I should be making a video of that sometime in coming weeks and I'm very excited for it because it's one of the most advanced um, projects I've made so far. It is quite complex and um, I'll be happy to show you that when I have finished it. Um, but until next time I hope you enjoyed this video, you'll be able to download this project from the Scratch 2.0 beta, but until then, see you next time.